Hello and welcome to Dart Tutorial. In this video, you will learn how to install Dart on your Windows operating system. There are multiple ways to install Dart on your Windows operating system. First of all, let's talk about requirements. You need to have Dart SDK. I, I will show you how to download Dart SDK and use it. Similarly, you uh, need to have VS Code that is Visual Studio Code or you can also use similar uh, editor like IntelliJ or uh, any other IDE. Uh, we will be using VS Code here throughout the tutorial. So how to install it on Windows? First of all, you need to download Dart SDK. Uh, I'm going to this URL. First of all, you need to download. I'm downloading for Windows. Here you can see. 64-bit uh, my operating system is 64-bit uh, you can also check your operating system bit from here uh, go to this PC okay go to this PC and go to properties here you can see your Windows operating system here you can see system type 64-bit operating system okay I'm going to download click on this dot SDK and it will uh, download that file it may take some time so similarly we also need to install VS code so for installing VS code you can go to code.visualstudio.com slash download and click on this windows option and uh, you can see our download has uh, started so it may take some time Okay, finally you can see our download has been completed successfully. First of all, click on this link and click on that SDK. Uh, you need to copy this that SDK, copy just copy this that SDK and paste it to your C drive. I'm going to paste it here. Uh, it may take some time. Similarly, we need to also uh, install VS Code. So, uh, Installing VS Code is very very easy. Just uh, you need to uh, click on next 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 and finish. Okay. Uh, accept the agreement. Next 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 and also don't forget to check all the option. Install. Okay. Now it is installing. Okay. Our uh, that SDK is almost ready to work here you can see 99 percent and here you can see 100 percent okay so to check uh, on your computer uh, that is installed or not so for that go to source and type cmd and just type that here and dash dash version okay that is not recognized as an internal or external command it is saying this so we need to go to our computer properties and so first of all let's go to lo local disk c and click on that sdk and click on bin you can just copy this link here just copy this link and go to this pc okay and go to properties and then go to advanced system setting and click on environment variables double click on this path and click on new and just paste it here paste it here and press ok and ok and ok so you need to also close the command prompt okay i'm going to close the command prompt and open cmd again now type that dash dash version okay here you can see our dart version is 2.16.2 and it is stable so let's run the dart program in order to run the dart program first of all open visual studio code and here you can see visual studio code and go to this extension you can download that extension from here just search for that and install this extension it make your work very very easier so uh, I'm going to create one folder that here 
and let's open this folder with vs code you uh, just right click there and open with code okay okay i'm going to trust this one okay just create one file i'm uh, creating hello dot dot okay okay i'm writing where main okay okay so let's run this program uh, open your terminal and just type dot okay and your file name hello dot dot here you can see the output hello sir so in order to create a dart project go to command i'm on the dart location go to command and just type here dart create my app okay okay here you can see one folder my app and also you can this uh, open this with vs code inside bin folder you can see there is my app uh, dot dot you can run this program by opening terminal and just hit dot run when you have uh, when your project is, is bigger then you need to uh, create a dart project when your project is smaller then you can also uh, write in one file but uh, if you are creating dart project and writing your code then uh, it will uh, manage your code files and uh, it is easy to connect multiple files and use packages in a Dart project. Thank you so much. If you have any question, comment below. And thanks for watching up to the very end. Thank you.